for Istio Day. Um, thanks to all our speakers as well, and we are so happy that we had uh, such a wide uh, variety of content. Uh, we're also so happy uh, that we could maintain the diversity uh, for the event as much as possible. Um, please stay back for the networking reception. Don't forget about that. And uh, Mitch would like to talk about the upcoming uh, Istio-related topics in the KubeCon uh, to tomorrow and thereafter. Yeah, huge thanks to everybody for joining us for our first ever in-person Istio event. This is something we've wanted to do for a very long time, and it's been a pleasure to do it uh, with you all here at KubeCon Europe. Um, I've, uh, I'm sharing a slide, and hopefully eventually it makes its way to the top. Uh, there, we are not done. There's a whole lot more Istio going on this week, particularly uh, starting Thursday at about 4 p.m. The service mesh track opens, and we'll hear about uh, Istio f creating Istio filters with any programming language. I assume that's a WASM talk. Uh, you can see the rest of the talks here. Look forward to seeing you at these talks coming out to support. Also, there's an Istio project update that I think is happening tomorrow. Uh, so plenty of more Istio to, to, to be happening. Also, if uh, you have any questions that you couldn't get into the details of with our speakers, many of our speakers are going to be at the Istio booth when the exhibit hall opens tomorrow. Uh, so look for us there within the, uh, the project pavilion. We'll be, we'll be there for all three days. All right, with that being said, thank you all very much. Hope you have a great KubeCon.